Hi guys, if you're dealing with apps and the App Store, especially the Google Play Console, you often have to grant access to certain other applications, for example, for uh, App Store optimization, for other maintenance tasks, and so on. Our tool, the App Store Localizer, also needs some access to publish metadata automatically. I'd like to show you how this can be set up. So log into your Google Play Console on the left side, navigate to Settings and then to API Access. You find here uh, some service accounts you already might have created. To create a new one, just go and create service account, click here. A pop-up shows and this pop-up will direct you to the Google API Console. So click here, a second window will appear or another tab and here you can add some more service accounts. On the top, just click on create service account and on the right side, give a name. My new service account for demo. Select the role. Um, of course, the application you like to give access decides which role is needed. In our case, in case of the iPhone the Elephant App Store localizer, you require project and editor access. It will be modified slightly there later. The rest can be like this and I click on save and a new service account is created. You'll find it uh, within here, my new service account for demo, it was a little bit shortened and next one you have to do is create a key. We require a JSON key right now, click create and a file is downloaded. I click on close, close. This key file is required for the service. So if another application tries to access your Play Store, you provide this key. But you're not done yet. Go back to the Google Play Console, click on done. You'll find your new service account within this list. So ours is this one. Now I click on Grant Access. Here I see this key has now access to everything in my store. Of course, I don't want to have that. I have some test apps I'd like to grant access to. For example, here this testy teaser man. So I remove all the other access rights. And now I can decide which rights I grant to this key file, to this service account, to this specific app. In the example of the I Want an Elephant App Store Localizer, uh, I don't need to credit or edit or draft apps. I won't need any financial data. I don't want to have the release management in here and I don't want to reply on reviews. Of course, you have to select all the rights which are necessary for the tool or service you are using. Once again, the I want an elephant app store localizer only needs this edit store listing and pricing distribution access right. So I click on add and now I'm all set. I can now go to my application, add this key file, and I'm good to go. Thanks for watching.